Hello and welcome to the IT Academy. Are you tired of adjusting fonts, colors, and logos on every single PowerPoint slide? There is a secret tool in PowerPoint that updates them all at once. It's called the Slide Master and it is a game changer. Let me show you how it works. So where can we find the Slide Master tool? To go to the Slide Master, you go to the view tab, click on the view tab, and then you go down here and you see different kinds of views. We have the normal view outline, reading view. So you click on view and slide master. So it opens up in another editing mode. This is not your normal mode. When you are here and you click on the first slide, the master slide, Whatever changes you make here will reflect on every single slide in your presentation. For instance, you're working for an organization that wants its logo to be displayed on each of the slides. When making a presentation, they want to make sure that their logo is visible on each slide. So you don't want to start inserting the logo manually one by one on each slide you can do it in one place and it reflects on every slide so let's go here the master slide and we're going to insert a logo so we go to insert pictures and i look for the logo this is it i double click on it and it is here you see that it is present on every single slide so it is obviously too big so we're going to reduce it okay we've reduced it and we come here still a little big okay i think it's fine here so let's close it when you have finished doing this you click on slide master and then you go to close master view so let's make our presentation and see you see that it is on every single slide let me go to the next slide on every single slide the logo is present okay so when you want to remove an object that you inserted through the slide master view you have to do this let's go back there you can't delete it in the normal view let's go back to the slide master by going to view and then slide master so we go to the first for you to delete it you have to go to the master slide the first one you can't delete it anywhere else you go there and you select it and you press delete and it's gone it's no longer on any of the slides let me close it and let's take a look you see that it's gone okay so that is one thing, a very useful feature you can use for your presentation. So sometimes you make a presentation and it doesn't look so professional because the fonts are all different, all kinds of different fonts on each slide. And that doesn't look very nice. You want all the slides to have the same font for that professional look. To do that, you don't have to go from slide to slide changing the fonts. While you are still in the slide master mode, you go to font. You click here and then you select the font that you want. Let's say I want Arial. So I select it and I close. It's going to apply it to every single slide. If I change it to another font, Let's see here, which other fonts can we notice very well. Let's make it Arial Black. You see, that's a very thick font. So when I close it, you can see that every slide has the same fonts, the same type of fonts, and it looks very professional. So what else can we do here in this editing mode? We can add the slide numbers. Supposing you want the slide numbers, which is the equivalent of page numbers to be displayed on your presentation on each slide. This is what you have to do. You simply go to, uh, make sure you are in the slide master mode and you go to insert and then you go on to the right to slide 
number. The number, number the slides in your presentation for easy reference. So you click here and what do we do? This is slide number. Okay. Okay. So we select that and we apply to all. So let's take a look. Let's go to slide master and close it. So let's make our presentation and see if the numbers will show. So we go to slide show from beginning. So this is the first slide. The header doesn't show. You can see here the numbers are displayed on each slide. For easy reference, if your audience wants to ask a question, they can refer to that slide number. I'm asking a question based on what you displayed on slide five or slide three. So it is a very useful feature. Now that you've seen how to use the slide master, your slides will never look messy again. Save time, look professional and impress your audience. If this helped you, please don't forget to like it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe and share with a friend. And if you want more easy tech tips, I've got plenty coming your way. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.